Hi, my name is Sadell Willow-Smith. I'm the co-founder of Sunshine Cinema. Awesome. How are you, Sadell? I'm good, thank you. Thank you for having me today. Thank you. It's an absolute pleasure. I know we had a bit of hiccups, but yeah, we're here now. So basically, um, I asked about the Film Impact Screening Facilitation Professional Development Program that will take place um, in June this year. Can you just unpack a bit more about that? So Sunshine Cinema is Africa's first solar-powered mobile cinema network. We're a leader in impact distribution of African films. We work with over 80 young people across the continent who use mobile cinemas to spark conversation. Based on that lived experience and learning over the last five years, we developed this course. So yeah. this is a course that's called the Impact Facilitator course. It's run with the Center for Film and Media Studies at the University of Cape Town. Yeah. It's a six month online course that takes participants through a variety of different modules that cover the world of impact producing. So how to use film to drive dialogue, how to use media to reach dynamic audiences for your marketing, for your outreach, for your impact. It's the kind of course that's designed for somebody who is a communications officer at a nonprofit, somebody who's an entrepreneur wanting to understand how to target and reach their audiences, storytellers, people who are public speakers, people who yeah. want to use story to drive social change. So that's what the course is about. And we have a variety of guest lecturers who um, take you through all the different modules of the course. Okay, that sounds exciting, actually. Um, I can say that most of us as Gen Z are a product of um, edutainment. That's your Soul City, your MTV Sugar. So what can we expect from these documentaries that um, are going to be made? That's a practical filmmaking course. A lot of people uh, mix mix that up. So Sunshine Cinema's work in impact facilitation focuses specifically on distribution. What yeah. happens once a film is made? And the documentaries that we showcase are a variety of documentaries from across the continent made by award-winning filmmakers. Some of those filmmakers are guest lecturers on the course, like Dylan Valley. We also have Anita Kana and Wanda Emily from Kenya. So mm. there's a whole world of impact filmmaking out there that's a bit different to edutainment. It's not so um, stringent in its genres. It's a little yeah. bit more are showing and we're also not only working with documentary um a lot, a lot of people come onto the course who are feature fiction filmmakers who want to understand dynamic ways that they can dis distribute their films yeah and how will it drive meaningful um activism because we do know that some activists they come and go where where is the sustainability in this so stories are always around. I think that that's um, something that is part of what makes us human. And it's really this course speaks to that and yeah. speaks to the power of what it means to bring people together collectively in a space, people who might not share the same opinions, people who can have dialogues across difference. And we've really seen that with a number of different films that we've shown as Sunshine Cinema. And we bring a lot of that experience into the teachings of the course. So, yeah. for example, you know, one way that we course is to develop their impact strategies for documentaries they've been working on. Recently, a film about her process of going through La Bola, and it's a film called La Bola Bride's Price, and, and was a bursary recipient on the course, and throughout yeah. the course developed a very interesting impact campaign of how she was going to use that film about South of Africa in yeah. very patriarchal spaces. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. And um, the course is available um, UCT online, or basically the lessons will be conducted through UCT online. Um, so for people that are watching our conversation right now, how do they get involved if they have an interest? So the course runs through the Center for Film and Media Studies at UCT. It's a non-credit bearing of Cape Town on successful completion. Yeah. We have synchronous sessions every Thursday. Uh -huh. So students do meeting two the times are still going to be decided for this year so there are a number of synchronous sessions and then there's self-study time throughout the week you need to dedicate about eight to ten hours a week over the six months to successfully complete the course yeah. and if anybody wants to apply for 
signing up, you can head over to sunshinecinema.org. Applications close in March and you'll find all the information under our impact course. And we really are excited to be able to say that we have quite a few scholarships available for deserving applicants from across the global south. But yeah. we do receive thousands of applications, so the competition is quite stiff. Okay, makes a lot of sense. I actually did fam. <laughs> it was quite fun. So um, this is really great. It's like, what else do you have um, to say in closing? So we look forward to just receiving as many different applicants from people people yeah. who are activists, storytellers, filmmakers, you know, it's really about network and about driving a conversation forward. I think that yeah. one really interesting part of the course is that because it's online, there are students from oh, Brazil oh. and Central America and East Africa and yeah. Polakwane. So it's like a really interesting mix of people who are doing That's brilliant. And obviously as creatives, we feed off each other. So I like that. Thank you. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Have a great day. Thank you. Have a good one too. We tried. <laughs>